I've gotten a lot of requests or questions like my kids going back to school. Um, what can I give them to build up their immunity um, and protect them from this COVID? So I'm going to show you guys this tonic that's kid friendly and of course tastes good for adults. Um, so here we go. So I already measured out here some burdock root. That is the one cup of burdock root. This is a half cup of elderberries, two cups of sorrel or hibiscus flour, and then one tablespoon, I'm lying, four tablespoons, so one cup of the sarsaparilla powder. I'll put the ingredient measurements in the notes below. And then here I have four cups of water already turned on, starting to boil, uh, waiting for that to boil, and we'll go from there. I'm going to add the hibiscus flour, burdock root, and elderberries to my hot water. One handed, of course, because the little one's still in my hand. And I didn't have any more cut or wood pieces of sarsaparilla, but if you do have that, then you would just do the same amount of burdock root. Because of the powder, I'm gonna save this for last. Now here I have some already made sea moss gel. We have some blue agave, and this is the amazing maple syrup that I was telling you guys about super delicious high in nutrients uh, they don't even you can't it's hard to even find grade b in stores now um and then the sarsaparilla powder that we'll add after this boils so we're just letting this boil and we'll be back only need to let this boil for about 10 to 15 minutes okay it's been about 20 minutes because i couldn't come back but this is definitely done beautiful color so this is going to make about one gallon of tonic or juice and uh, the reason why I made so much is because this is actually for a friend of mine um, she has two kids and she's a school teacher so she definitely needs to build up their immune system you're gonna give one shot of this to each uh, person taking it at night all right so now I'm going to strain this. Be very careful and slow. This will stain your clothes. That's why I'm wearing a, a dress I don't really care about. Pushing it down a little bit. Trying to get most of the juice out. And I just slid another bowl underneath there. Moving this out the way. I'm going to put this back in my pot because it's still super hot and I don't want this to cool down in the pot. Now I'm going to add my sarsaparilla powder and I'm going to measure out some CMOS gel, one cup. The average recommended dose for a child over one year is one tablespoon. So for this gallon worth of juice or four quarts, one cup is good. So if you're giving your child CMOS anything else, it's up to you, but this is all they really need for one serving a day. I'm going to add this to the juice while it's still hot. So on the same one cup that I did the sea moss and I added some maple syrup and a mix of agave. I don't like to do all agave because the 
glycemic index level is better with maple syrup actually and there's more nutrients in iron I mean in iron in the maple syrup Next, I'm going to hand mix this. If you don't have a hand mixer, you can just put it in a blender. It's up to you. Now you can also do this in a different way where you do the elderberry separate so you can blend the elderberries mixed in because the elderberry fruit in itself is actually really good. I think it's perfect. I don't want it too sweet for children. I personally don't even like drinks that sweet myself. So there you go. That's the tonic. Looks like I have some extra. Anybody want some? Let me know. Now, if you're breastfeeding, this is a great tonic that you can add nettle to and take for yourself. Children under one or however, whatever age you're breastfeeding, they will get these as well, these nutrients. Um, in about three to four hours, once you eat something, it goes to your breast milk, especially when it's herbs. So if you're breastfeeding, add some nettle to this. Um, nettle doesn't have much flavor, but it gives a nutrient-dense um, milk. So there you are. You have your tonic, sassafrilla, bird root, burdock root, elderberry, hibiscus, or sorrel flower, uh, some agave and maple syrup, 